Okay, so bit of an unboxing today, and uh, this is going to be the Doctor Who Doctor Dalek Big Finish exclusive uh, B and M character option figure thing. I don't know, whatever. You read the title. You know what we're waiting for. I've got a knife. Run away, I might kill you. Yeah. So I, I imagine everyone else is probably getting these around the same time who was uh, lucky enough to order them. Also, big finish. Um, really fucking random when you decided to release these. If I hadn't have been checking the website constantly, I would I, literally. I had no idea when these were going to be listed. Neither did anyone else. I don't think even Big Finish knew. So it meant that most people weren't able to get one. They sold out in less than half an hour. Well, anyway, here they are. So first up, we've got the War Doctor and Dalek scientists. Um, the only difference with this one is, I believe, is that the shoulder sections here are silver. If we can maybe get a good look at that, it's hard because it's reflecting off everything. But I do believe that that's the only difference with that. This one, you obviously got the big finish sticker there. And information on the back. Now, to be honest, why... Have they not done this Dalek variant for either this or the B&M one? Especially if you're going to put this artwork on the side. And before some people see, it is definitely fucking blue. Not silver, that is blue. So yeah. That one's that. We've got the Seventh Doctor with Attack Squad Strike uh, Dalek thing. And uh, the only major difference with him is, uh, I believe, the trousers are slightly different. And also, uh, his jumper is, or waistcoat as it's trying to masquerade, is definitely darker. And I do believe that's it with that one. And uh, with the eighth Doctor from Dark Eyes, his uh, shoes are black. Again, it's hard to see, but they are black on this one, not brown. And the Dalek, um, hmm, yeah, the Dalek can't really see any differences, other than this one see appears to have no weathering on it and be completely clean. Uh, this, again with the War Doctor one, yeah, the weathering is only more slight on it. I won't be opening any of these, by the way. I don't own any of the B&M sets yet because they haven't been released. Because uh, unlike some people, Captain Jimmy Pie, I didn't suck characters' dick in order to get them for free. So yeah, uh, these obviously, I know some people are just going to be annoyed at this very video for the fact that I actually have these. Believe me, it's nothing less of a fucking miracle that I have these. Because, again, they sold out within half an hour of them being up. And also, now, the sets themselves, you have to buy all three for uh, 60 quid. Which, you know, it's fair enough, that's how much they would charge if you are buying them from B&M when they get released later this month. Okay, fair enough. But then, £10 fucking delivery. Now, these were delivered by uh, DPD. And yeah, I've got uh, the invoice here. You can see there, £10 for delivery. I'm just like, there's no fucking way these cost £10 to deliver. 
no way on this earth do these cost £10 to deliver. Especially if you go and buy uh, DPD. I mean, if you went Royal Mail, this probably wouldn't even cost you a tenner. A fiver at the most. But the thing is, I think the reason why is probably because Big Finish want their exclusive um, Onyx as well. So anyway, yeah, that's it for these sets. I will do um, a greater look at them when I do get my hands on the B&M versions just to compare. But yeah, that's them. Yeah, and then... To be honest, if you didn't get these, you're not huge. You're not really missing out on much. So yeah, that's it for this video. And I'll see you when I can be asked to do something else. Bye-bye.